Good morning. Good morning, Nicolas. How are you? Hi, good morning. How are you? I'm very good. I'm very good. Uh, how's it's the temperature hot here. there? Ult very hot, very hot. It's like 30, 35 degrees each day since two weeks or so. So I assume totally different to your countryside or not? Or Yeah, we, we are wearing a little bit more clothes uh, to keep us <laughs> uh, warm enough. Yeah, so it's, it's, it's not that cold, but it's uh, like uh, 16 or 18 degrees Celsius. So okay. yeah, it's a little bit colder. Okay. Do the houses have heating in the in the houses or not? Are they not installed heatings? Um, well, normally they don't or not like a lot. So we have an our Airbnb where we stay and uh, it's, there's no heating other than just like a simple radiator that you can plug in the wall. Oh, OK, so electric radiator or something like that. Yeah, exactly. OK, so an emergency radiator. If you're freezing a lot, you sit in front of the radiator. <laughs> exactly, yeah. They had uh, there was snow for the first time in many years close to where we are now. Uh, on, of course, on the more higher, uh, to, uh, like uh, mountains, okay. but it's quite uh, um, strange to have snow here in Cape Town, close to Cape Town. Uh, very interesting. Yeah. yeah, let's let's switch to the to your car and to your battery. I think um, I think that's the best. And many uh, readers and, and and viewers are interested in what what happens to the battery. And I think I will directly sh uh, share my screen. Yeah, so far we uh, we uh, yeah are very happy, uh, of course, with the car, but also with the battery. Uh, yeah, so we are still yeah, in so one we piece. Are still in one piece. Yeah. <laughs> so what I have here is what I brought is a flash test. So a very quick report that was done in September last year when the mileage was only 16,000 kilometers. And we showed a score of 97 points. So there are many categories. There are five categories um, that we evaluate for that total score. And on the back side, and I will switch to the back side, it's also quite interesting. We show the readout state of health of the car itself, of the battery, of the battery management system. And it's 96%. So. When the car was, let's say, nearly new or before your journey, before your big travel, it was 96%. And on the right side, you can see the flash test report, which was done um, last week. Yeah, it was on the 8th, last week, around about, uh, with the same categories, but with another order. So we ordered mm -hmm. the most important category in on the top. Um, and you have 96 points or score of 96, which is quite very good which is very very good and now i scroll down to the red out to the soh of the manufacturer and it's 94 percent so you lost regarding the manufacturer only two percent and if you take our evaluation you lost just one point so like you can see Not here the is the battery is still in a very very good mood it's very nice. good and the question is now, what is your experience from the last month um, of driving? Did you recognize any problem, any reduction in, in, in range or so or not? No, yeah, we, um, for us, it also felt like this. So we were really curious for the test results, of course, as far as it's only a feeling, but we haven't really experienced any degradation in range or or anything so yeah it, it doesn't really surprise us although it is really nice to have it confirmed yeah yeah and uh, and for us it's quite difficult to to compare with other countries because every country has its own challenges on the road wise so uh, yeah in Namibia we had very bad roads and that consumed way more energy so it's it's difficult to compare but still we had the feeling that our battery was uh, was in a good condition as well uh, because when we are charging with our solar panels then you constantly hear well, not not all the time, but we hear that the, the, the car cools the battery down during the day uh, or even heating it up in the morning. So the car is really constantly working to to keep the battery alive or in uh, an optimal condition. Yeah, I think the very interesting experience is that when you are charging slow with DC, so with direct current, mm -hmm. uh, so direct from solar, that means or that that results in the best condition of the battery regarding the temperature. So that's, a, I think, a very, very interesting experience you made there uh, because normal, no normal user is using the DC charger with only 10 kilowatt or so. But that was very interesting that 
when it was cold, it was heated up, but like you said, and when it was very hot, it was cooled down to always the temperature mm -hmm. that is the best for the battery. And that's very, very interesting. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Because, uh, yeah, of course, the way we are charging, the car thinks it will get a way higher current yeah. uh, than, <laughs> than we, will, uh, we can provide with our solar panels. Uh, but we had the same. We just give it slowly to the, I think the highest we charge was like eight kilowatts or something, mm -hmm. not yeah. much higher. Um, yeah, so, but it's, it's interesting. So is there something to say about that? This, is, this would be uh, like more healthy for a car battery to charge DC uh, than to charge it via AC? Well, <clears throat> um, I would say um, with that low power, it's better because of the temperature. Um, uh, because yeah. the temperature is set up to a higher temperature. When you are charging with AC in, in, in Netherlands or in, in, the, in the northern countries like Austria, Germany, um, then in winter the battery has only five, six, seven degrees and the battery is not heated up um, at up to 20 degrees or 25 degrees, like it was done um, when you charged up with the solar power, with the DC yeah. solar power. And that's better, uh, of sense. course. Yeah, that's better, yeah, of course. Yeah. But I think that's not a big or a huge difference because you still have a low power um, when you're charging AC. So you have a very low power and that's not um, that, that, that doesn't damage the battery when you charge it up at only seven or eight degrees. But it would be better if it had would have 20 degrees or 25 degrees, yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah. 